Difference between impulse turbine and reaction turbine. Differences. In an impulse turbine, pressure, enthalpy, drop occurs completely in the stator stage. In reaction turbine pressure, enthalpy, drops in both rotor and stator stages. Impulse turbines have none in the stator. The reaction turbines have two sets of nozzles, in the stator and rotor. In impulse turbines, only the kinetic energy is used to generate shaft energy. In reaction turbines, both pressure and kinetic energy are converted to shaft energy. The operation of impulse turbines explained using Newton's third law. Operation of reaction turbines are explained using Newton's second law. An impulse turbine generates mechanical energy completely from the impulse of the fluid when impact on the rotor blades. A reaction turbine uses the fluid from the nozzle to create momentum on the stator wheel. In an impulse turbine, the velocity of the fluid is increased by passing through a series of nozzles before being directed to the rotor blades. The stator blades act as the nozzles and increase the velocity by reducing the pressure. In a reaction turbine, a series of nozzles increases the velocity of the fluid stream in the stator, in the stator stage. This creates a pressure drop and an increase in velocity. Pelton wheels and de Laval turbines are examples of the impulse turbines. Francis turbine, Kaplan turbine, and many of the modern steam turbines belong to this category.